In an interview this morning, you said that the government has underestimated you. How? Well, I've been underestimated my whole life. <laughs> my whole life has been one whereby I haven't got a leg up. Uh, I've fought for everything that I've got. I lead a team that has plans for the future. This government, this government are still relying upon today, today, another scare campaign based upon a lie, based upon the same untruths that they put forward during the 2019 campaign. They said that electric vehicles would end the weekend. On climate change, your um, short-term 2030 target is 43. Where have you actually got the number 43 for? Why have you not gone 45 or higher? Because what we didn't do, and we explained this in full at the time when we announced our policy, what we didn't do was say, OK, let's pick a number and then work back from there. What we did was we went, what is good policy? What makes a difference? And rewiring the nation was announced in 2019. This has been around for three years and the government have three years later got a front page splashes in tabloids uh, based upon not quite sure what. Uh, Angus Taylor can't say what it's based upon uh, in interviews he's given this morning. Uh, we did the hard yards on that. What we did was we worked through all of the policies and then Reputex did the modelling and it found that that would reduce emissions by 43% by 2030. That's how you do good policy.